Here we have it, folks. It's a Tesla coil. Uh, slowly built, uh, all pretty much by scratch. Um, I got the transformers mostly from microwaves and uh, balusters in line with the transformers. There's two MOTs, they're at 2,000 volts a piece. And as you can see, the, because they're in line, I got two capacitors at 2,000 volts each, but in series to be 4,000 volts. And you can see the diodes there that protect the transformers uh, from the back surge. Uh, I'm getting new diodes in actually because the, these ones are actually not strong enough. So I uh, pulse the system to make it work and not over uh, surge it too much there because I blow out the diodes. Uh, then I got a rotary spark gap system, uh, which uh, you can see it spins and it's uh, regulated if you look over here by a switch which I can control at a distance, so I'm not nowhere near the spark system uh, while I'm uh, running the system. So it makes it very safe. And uh, first things first, I always like to excite the capacitors really quick. So we're just going to show, because Nick is going to go up there and uh, from a distance, so it's safe. As you can see, everything from a distance there. So I'm gonna turn on the system right now and I'm gonna charge up the capacitors just to show you the spark that it makes before I actually get the thing running in motion. So I'm just gonna turn it on really quickly just to charge it up really quick. That's it, quick, quick charge. And you saw that spark there, how big it was? So we know the system's online and it's ready, the capacitors are, uh, they, they charge up. So now we're going to show off the lights and we're going to fire this puppy up. Tesla coil with a rotary spark system. That was a good video, eh? Mm-hmm. Oh.